Lake Buena Vista, FLA. It seems crazy, the concept of the Yankees trading their top prospects for Manny Machado when they can simply sign him outright as a free agent in the 2019 offseason. Then again, Giancarlo Stanton to the Bombers for almost nothing seemed crazy too, until the stars aligned and it actually happened. An ESPN report said Tuesday that the Yankees had expressed interest in the Orioles' superstar third baseman, who appears to be available on the trade market. Machado, 24, has averaged 35 homers, 92 RBIs and an .840 ups over the last three seasons. It certainly makes sense that Baltimore, worried about losing Machado for nothing a year from now, would reach out to New York and 29 other teams trying to find the best possible match. And the Bombers' deep farm system, highlighted by MLB.com's number one overall prospect in all of baseball, Glaber Torres, makes them an obvious candidate to talk to. But you wonder how many teams would feel confident enough that they could resign Machado to a long-term deal to surrender a ton for a player that could leave for another team next year. The White Sox, Phillies and Cardinals have been connected with Machado. Patrick Smith Getty Images also, Orioles owner Peter Angelos, 88, HASNT been inclined to want to go through a rebuild. Plus, would he really want to do a trade with the hated Yankees Machado, who made $11.5 million in 2017 and wants to play shortstop in 2018, is also going to be due a raise in his final arbitration year, and the Bombers have a mandate from ownership to get under the $197 million luxury tax threshold, so it would take some heavy financial finagling to add him in much-needed starting pitching. And who is taking on Jacoby Ellsbury's three-year, $68 million albatross with the no-trade clause the Yankees are currently about $30 million under the threshold. It feels like the only way this would occur is if a scenario similar to Stanton happened. Willie J. Allen Jr. AP is in, no teams want to take a chance on the uncertainty regarding Machado's future, and the Orioles have nowhere to turn but the Yankees, who can get him at a lesser price than sacrificing Torres, Estevan Florial and Justice Sheffield, among others. So Baltimore makes the move and takes the massive PR hit to avoid losing Machado for nothing. The idea of the Bombers stacking Machado, Aaron Judge, Stanton, Greg Bird, Gary Sanchez and Didi Gregorius is downright insane. Still, it seems more plausible that it could happen in the offseason when Machado becomes a free agent, rather than this season. But given it's the Yankees, you can never say never.